today's morning minute, kingdom of God living with freedom, with freedom, without accusation. Once you were alienated from God and were enemies in your own, in your minds because of your evil behavior, but now, now he has reconciled you by Christ's physical body through death to present you holy in his sight without blemish and free from accusation. Colossians chapter 1 verse 20, 21 and 22. Do you feel holy? Do you feel spotless without blemish? Do you feel the freedom from the accuser, the devil? The devil has a playground in your mind. The devil is the great accuser which wants you to believe your feelings and not trust the truth in the word of God. The devil is a slanderer. He can take a truth or fact and use it destructively against you. He can take a truth or fact and use it destructively against you. The, the facts are the facts are you have been reconciled to God through Jesus Christ's death and resurrection. This is a fact. You may not feel reconciled, but this does not change the fact. Believe and walk in the fact of your reconciliation with God. God did not send his son to die for your feelings. He sent his son to die to, for you to give birth to his spirit, which is alive in you through Christ Jesus. Speak out loud and claim you're alive in Christ. Your body is dying and decaying. However, the spirit of God is alive in you. This is your born again spirit, which has been birthed in the spirit of God. God is spirit, and you must worship him in spirit and truth. You're made in God's image, which is spirit. This is your new nature. The old nature of the flesh is dead and dying. The new nature is alive and growing in Christ Jesus. The enemy of God wants to render you ineffective in the kingdom of God. The enemy's method is to get you to believe your feelings. The enemy wants you to focus on your old nature. You are not saved. This is the old nature. You're not saved. You're not worthy. You're not, you don't feel like you are holy. You're not righteous. You don't deserve salvation. Did you really receive salvation? I don't feel reconciled to God. The enemy is battling for control of your mind, emotions, and feelings. As long as he has control of these areas, you will live in a, in a defeated, you'll be living as a defeated believer. The enemy hates you taking authority over the mind, feelings, and emotions. The enemy hates when you walk in your position as the son and daughter of the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. The enemy hates when you forgive others as Christ has forgiven you. You are without blemish and free from the accusations of the accuser. You are holy and righteous in Christ Jesus. Your Heavenly Father's image of you is what counts. He sees you as his child and loves you unconditionally. He sees you as spotless, without blemish, totally forgiven of your sin. You're made in God's image and likeness. You're a child of God living in the kingdom of God now through the Holy Spirit. Amen and amen.